what's up YouTube? It's your boy Deji. Um, so I this video is to help people try to connect to a hotspot, and some hotspots require you to log in. But uh, if the uh, login page doesn't automatically pop up, you know you get frustrated because you can't connect to the Wi-Fi. So um, you call the tech people; they can't help you. So you go to YouTube and you watch this video, and then you get the answer. So I've been having this trouble with Xfinity Wi-Fi. I got it working, and I was trying to mess it up again so I could uh, show you that it's um, how to fix it. But I already got it working, so um, I can't I can't really mess it up to show you that it works. But I'll just show you what I did to fix it. So what I did was I I clicked this um, I clicked properties not properties I, I didn't do that I clicked uh I right I clicked this I don't know what I did. I go on control panel, right? Then you're gonna go in network set network and view network status. So you try to get to this part. You're gonna click the Wi-Fi extremity. You're gonna click uh, Wi-Fi properties. No, you're, not. you're gonna click properties. Then you're gonna click IP TCP IPv4. Just double click it. Now, what for me that was messed up was the fact that there was numbers here. And I set it to DNS server address automatically for IPv4. And once I did that, I disabled, I turned, I disconnected and reconnected, and it worked. So that's it. So pretty much check your DNS settings on IPv4. And uh, if you fix that, if you set it to automatic, it should work. Thanks for watching this video. Please, uh, you know, if you, if it works for you, you can like it or whatever. I don't really care if you like it. I don't even care if you comment it. Just like, you know, I like when, when people comment because then I know it works for them. And if it doesn't work for them, I can give you some more tips. All right, good luck, y'all. Peace out. God bless you. Happy New Year.